Hi guys, welcome back. Oh, I'm so glad to see y'all. So anyway, I hope everybody's doing great. I know if you're from Texas, it's been rough. You know, it was hell week last week. But you know, we got our we got our lights back on. As you can see, you know, you can't work a glue gun without lights, you know. So it was a little rough. And if you're from Texas, gosh, I know. It's been, you know, what can you what can I say? You know, I always say that living in Texas is like walking through a you know, a revolving door. We walk through and hurricane hits us and we clean it all out. We pull out the sheetrock, we start over, we patch up the roof, and then we push through and it comes back and hits us again. Well, this time we got hit, you know, we got hit and I hope we don't get hit again. So anyway, I was trying to clean up and I was like, look at these hands, you know, what can I do? So anyway, cheers everybody. So glad to see you. So come on back for this cute little craft. And before I get started, I wanna do a shout out to all the sweet people out there. So I've been watching everybody's channels and thank you for keeping me entertained because you know, we were going through the, the roller coaster of lights and when I had lights, I was watching y'all. So anyway, Bob Dingo, you know, his channel's great. You know, I love enthusiasm. You know, I want someone to lift me up. And, you know, I try to make myself happy every day. And this guy, he loves Vegas. You know, he's so happy about everything. And Granny, Gambling Granny, if you haven't been to her channel, Gambling Granny's show is great. Her and I, you know, we were both on Bob's channel the other night. We were going through all this. You know, we were helping him out. You know, we were trying to, like, get everybody pumped up. And he's great. And also Slot Donkeys. I enjoy watching everybody, so thank you for coming to see me. I want to do a shout out to y'all. You know, if you, you know, I want to see people win, so thank you. And So Cargo, she's got a really great channel. You know, oh my gosh, I'm gonna be checking her stuff out. So thank you for checking me out. I'm gonna check you out. Slot Hopper, very cute girl. Oh my gosh, she picks all the same machines I would. You know, I'm, I'm thinking she knows exactly what I like to play. I would play everything she was playing, and she's doing great. So, and I love her red hair. I'm, trust me. I'm, I'm a lot older than her, but I'm thinking about going that color red. I love that. And uh, sweet and spicy, that lady can cook. So, you know, I need all the recipes I can get right now. You know, I had no oven, and it was killing me, but I was cooking everything on top. And uh, I was eating a lot of sandwiches. So if anybody has any ideas for emergency food, oh my gosh, you would be a hit in Houston. So if you can think of things you can make in a hurry or a lot of, you know, I was boiling eggs, I was making sandwiches, I was preparing salads that I had and everything, you know, you could only do it in the ice chest and keep it all, you know, in the generator and all that. It was a mess. I mean, you know, we did the best we could. A lot of peanut butter, you know, you know how it is. But thank you for coming back and wait till you see this cute project. Uh, it's a purse. I know. I was cleaning stuff out, and I was going to throw these away. These are placemats. I know that's crazy. I know. A placemat. And I thought, I'm, I'm throwing all this away. I was cleaning stuff. I thought, I don't need more placemats. I barely even use them. So, anyway, I, I thought, you know, I think I can make something out of this. You know how I am, you know. I'm always... I'm always thinking, you know, I'm recycling stuff. So, I did this one last night. I did this last night, and this is so simple. You know, use what you have. They're at the dollar store. I got these at the dollar store, and I think they're at Walmart, too, for like $1.50. But the dollar store has them for a dollar. So, I, I just thought that was so easy. And, in fact, you know what? I had one that was that I had bought, and I can't find it now. It was, it's been around here somewhere. I'm like, well, I had bought a purse you know, at a, at like at a, at a Michael's or something that was done like this. And I spent money on it. And I thought I could have made that. So anyway, this is so easy, guys. Grab an old strap off a bag and I'll show you. But all you're going to do is you're going to hot glue it. That's how easy it is. And if you want to put a snap on it, you can. But I'm thinking about putting a ribbon, you know. And I don't, you know, I don't have my ribbon now. But I'm going to make a fun one. This one's kind of ladylike, you know. It's going to be my little Galveston purse when I walk down the strand and I get the same thing every time. You know, I buy my chocolate. I buy my little friendship bracelet that I like there. I buy a little t-shirt. You know, I buy the same stuff. It's kind of open, casual, and it's lightweight. Or you could use it by the pool because if it gets wet, nobody cares. You know, you could use this. You could put your little, you know, your little stuff you're going to have. Your suntan lotion, your, you know, you know, maybe a book or something. And trust me, it holds just by just by doing this. So here's my pom-poms. I'm gonna make this one kind of fun. I've got a Hello Kitty patch that I got off an old jacket that I, oh, I think this was off of a, like a little, I don't know if it was a book bag or something, but anyway, I found that. Oh, and cheers. Trying to drink more water, you know. What can I do? I bet it's been soda after soda. I'm like, I gotta get off that soda. Thanks for joining me, guys. 
And all you're gonna do, you're gonna get, you're gonna decide how, how big you want your opening. That's the only thing. You know, if you want a really little, you know, if you just want a little gap there, that's up to you. But I kind of did a big one because I know myself. I'm gonna be putting all kinds of little treats in there. So, whoops. Okay, here we go. I'm just going really quick around the, around the edge. And then I'm putting it together like a sandwich. And you know, don't burn yourself. Use something, you know, use a pen or use your scissors. Don't burn yourself. And remember where your gap is. <laughs> That's what I was gonna say. Remember where you started at, because then you might you might glue the whole thing together. So I'm gonna rotate over here and I'm just gonna continue. I'm just gonna continue. Oops, got a piece of glue there. Okay. I'm just gonna continue on. And I'm just gonna attach it again. And it holds. I can't believe it does, but it does. Because I was going to use all kinds of stuff. I thought about sewing it. And I thought, no, you know, I'm making this harder than it is. I thought, this doesn't need to be this hard. You know, I thought, make it easy. It's a casual little bag. I liked it. It looks, you know, it looks kind of neat, you know. It looks kind of nice. And I have my old book bags, you know, that I could use for the pool and stuff. But, you know, and we go to Galveston. In fact, my husband is fishing. You know, life is kind of coming back to normal. I said, go catch a dinner. You know, we can have fish tacos tonight. So, you know, when we're, we were stuck at home. You know, we were isolated. My husband has to work. So, I was kind of here by myself. You know, they call him to work. You know, you got to work. It's an emergency. Get on up here. So, I was all by myself through this. And I was like, oh, my God. This stinks. Oh, this is the worst. So anyway, I got busy. I got busy. I started making stuff. I started cleaning. I started, oh, all the plants died. I started pulling up the plants. That's why my hands look like this. So this is so cute. And if you want, you could even paint something on here. I thought you could make a little design, but I have all this leftover stuff. You know me, I got leftover junk. When I used to sew and make purses, I had all this. That's why I did this. And I just attached my little pom-poms. And these are at the dollar store. I picked out the black ones for this one, but I was thinking I might make, you know, like I tell you, I wanna make this one a, bit, a little bit more fun, a little bit more fun. And I think that gap is just about right. You know, I can put some stuff in there. And if you want to, you know, you can put some clips around or some clothespins. It's no big deal. And I'm going to make this one kind of just a squiggle. You know, I'm just going to do a squiggle and see if I can attach that. Because I just think it's fun and it's different. But I kind of liked it. You know, I kind of liked it. I thought, I thought, you know, I can make this any way I want. I could have made one. I could have made one with lots of flowers. And also you could do the clutch. That's what I was gonna tell you. That, you know, I'm not gonna show y'all clutch because I know a lot of people don't like wearing purses without straps. But I like clutch purses for going out or dinner because I put the clutch on the table. You know, I don't have to leave it anywhere. But, you know, this is just, this is just easy. And if you don't have this kind of like a little upholstery stuff that I happen to have, use bows. I thought little bows, you tie bows, you could attach bows to this. Bows and flowers would be so cute. So, you know, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just gonna be, you know, I'm just gonna test this out. You know, I'm, you're working with me, you know. I'm going as I, you know, I talk and go. And I just, you know, this is so easy. You know, I mean, anybody could do this. And I, if you're from the, you know, if you grew up in the 80s, you remember everybody was making the placemat, the placemat little clutch. And that was, and, and I had several, you know, I would use them. But, you know, you, this one's better. I think this idea is a little bit better. Because, like I tell you, nobody wants to do anything without a strap. But what I can tell you is don't, if you want to make your own straps, that's up to you. I didn't want to. I, I even had denim out last night and I was like, you know, do I really want to do all that? And I thought, no. And look, see, I'm, I'm kind of short here. I'm not, I don't have enough. I mean, I have some and I can keep going, but I'm just showing y'all real quick. But I'm, I'm, I'll go around. I have my, I have my other stuff, but here's my little patch. I'm going to make the, oops, I got my glue stuff here. Got my little patch. Let's see, okay, that's gonna be my opening. I think I'll put my patch in the middle. Yeah, why not? Let's show everybody we love Hello Kitty. I love Hello Kitty. Whoops, let me see. Yep, 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 yep. I like it, I like it. Yep, I do like it. You know, and you know, I can make this look like a little telephone cord. And it's just fun. You know, if you have a patch or something maybe you got it on a vacation 
Or if you have a little bandana, I thought bandanas, and you cut them in hearts. You could take it out, and it doesn't matter if it's frayed. It would be so cute, kind of like a casual, kind of chic deal, you know, where it's like, uh, uh, kind of like a, what, what do they call that? Like a boho. That's it. And I just wanted to make this fun. I just thought, you know, this is just cute. This is just cute. But get an old strap, like I tell you. I save old straps off purses. I see them. Or I go to Goodwill, and if I see a good strap, I save it. I save it because I think, you know, good straps, those are kind of hard to find. So what you do is you're just gonna cut. You're just gonna cut the top and insert your straps. Now you're gonna have to have the strap with the hooks, the little hooks. But you can see where this is going, girls. If you wanna make it really elaborate and you wanna align the inside of it, you could do that, but I didn't want to. And look, I even had this pom-pom fringe I could have used. And I might just make a little handle, um, uh, just a little purse handle. And I don't know. I don't really think I need my flower. I don't know. I kind of like it. I kind of like it. Yeah, I think I might. Yeah, I think I will. I think I will do my flower. Yeah, this is all over the place. This is all over the place. It's fun. It's mine. I like it. I do what I want. <laughs> I like that one. I play what I want. Somebody's got a site. I play what I want or I gamble what I want. That's hilarious. I really like that. So, okay. So, here's, here's the only thing. Okay, what you're going to need to put your strap on. Let me see if I can even get this one off now. Thanks, I don't think I can. Okay, I might have to. Okay, well, anyway, I'm gonna show y'all how I did this because, let me see if I can get this one off. Okay, this might be my bloopers. It's my bloopers, Granny. Okay, here we go, here we go. Did I get this one off? Okay, I got it off, okay. Let me show you, I can't get this one off, but. Okay, I'm gonna show y'all real quick how I did this. And all you're gonna do is you're gonna get your ice pick. I know, don't kill anybody. But here's your ice pick. You're gonna put it where you want and you're gonna cut as close as you can to the edge without going over or tearing it. So I'm just gonna push it right there. I'm gonna push it right there. And you kind of, you kind of pull up a little bit and then you insert your scissors. Super duper easy. Insert your scissors right there. I cut a little slice. You can see my fingernail through there. And then you're gonna get your loop. You're gonna do your loop. There you go. There you go. Look how easy that was. Look, super duper easy. So now you've just used an old strap. You're probably gonna throw away or recycle it again, you know? And you can add a little charm to the top of the purse, you know? And this is kind of drying still, so I don't wanna put anything in it for y'all, but you know, to show y'all. But I found these tassels off of an old shirt I had, and I thought it was so cute. I thought, you know, I think I'm gonna take that old tassel and I think I'm gonna do something with it. What, let me see how I did this. Okay, and that's just gonna be my little decoration. But you know, you know, why throw it away? You know, why, you know, I had all these placemats and I thought, I'm really gonna do something with these. And I thought, this is gonna be, and my husband's kind of looking at it like, what are you doing with that? And he actually, actually, when I was done, he was kind of like, hey, you know, that doesn't look too bad, you know? Kind of gave me a little bit of credit there, you know? I was like, yeah, that's not too bad. I was like, yeah, they were going in the trash, I told him. I was gonna throw them away. Okay, here's my little charm. Yeah, see, it's busy, it's fun, you know, and what I was gonna tell you is if you have an extra one and you do like the clutch, you can use the clutch. Here's a red one that I happen to have and so it's got a dent in it, unfortunately. But what you're gonna do is you can make a taco purse and I've seen these and a there is a, I think there's a YouTube video on this. Let me get one that bends better. Here's, here's a maroon one, okay. Okay, here's one that bends better. But you could do the taco deal with a snap at the top. You know, you just make it into a taco, you know, just like that, and then you add your fringe. And you know, like I tell you, you could use anything. You could use these little balls on here, super duper easy, and put a snap, and if you don't wanna do a snap, do a bow. Put, a, put, your, uh, put your hole in here, and then add your little ribbon. So anyway, I'll show these off at the end, you know, my thumbnail, but thanks for coming back, guys. I don't wanna keep anybody. Have a good Sunday, and I'm glad to be back, okay? Keep up the good work, everybody. And Granny, I'm counting down those days with you. I need to be in Vegas. So anyway, you show me Vegas when you get there, and I can't wait. And I'm so glad you like the face mask. Yes, I'm so glad. Uh, I was in a hurry, you know, and I went out and got fabric, and I thought, I'm going to send those before they leave. You know, I, I was just wanted y'all to, you know, have something in Vegas. So, anyway, have a good day, everybody, and please be safe, okay? Thank you. Bye.